Hello from Kelly Hicks Construction in Sublette, Illinois. Welcome to my video. This is a Wildwood 2010 model. It's a 2010 Wildwood LA series. It's a model 292 FKDS. Um, I'm going to demonstrate the electric awning and all the fine features on this trailer. Go ahead and roll the awning out. Push a button and out it goes. The latest and greatest wildwood. This trailer has a lot of options on it. I'm going to tell you about a few of them. Go ahead and roll that back in. Simple as the push of a button. It's got a six gallon gas electric DSI water heater. It's got outside speakers. It's got an outlet to hook up some awning lights here. This is the 292 FKDS. It's Aluma structure vacuum bonded. That means it has aluminum studs and the fiberglass is bonded to the aluminum. It's not a stick and tin. You have mag wheels. You have an exterior shower. There's another outside speaker. It's got stabilizer jacks on all four corners. It's got a ladder to get up on the roof. All Wildwoods have a walk-on roof. This one has enclosed heated underbelly. It's a four-season camper. It has park cable and a satellite dish hookup. Be sure to watch my slideshow video as well. Let's go on inside and I'll tell you about some more features this trailer has. Like I say, it's got a barbecue grill that mounts outside here. It's called the RVQ grill. That goes right here on this rail and the propane hookup for it is right there kinda nice you don't have to worry about bringing your own grill you already got one the bar stools are an option it's got the double air hide a bed sofa freestanding dinette with Eve and there's the built-in DVD player and stereo we'll go ahead and shut that off for now as soon as I find the power button, yes, that is the built-in DVD and surround sound stereo. This has the ducted roof air, comes with the swivel rocker, power stools, extra large double door fridge, dual sink covers that double as cutting boards, three burner stove and oven I'll show you inside the fridge here nice big fridge this is I think the only model that comes with a king bed that's a king bed here with storage underneath it's got lift props. There's the barbecue grill. It's called an RVQ grill, Flame King. There's the jack uh, cranker handle for the stabilizer jacks. It's got a nice chest of drawers. Overhead cabinets. This has tinted windows. You can see out real good, but you can't see in at all. They're like a mirror. Got a CO2 detector. 
I'll show you how the slides work. Here's the slide button. Slide the slide in. There you have it. The slide is in. Okay, here's the bathroom. It's got an exhaust fan. The toilet's in its own little room here. It is a foot flush porcelain toilet. Flush it with your foot, see? See my foot flush? And that's real porcelain. Just like a house. Okay, out of the shower now, or out of the toilet room. You can do your shaving. Medicine cabinet. And shower and shower surround with the skylight. You tall people will appreciate that. That's a double air height of bed sofa. That's an upgrade. There is day night shades in this. I should pull one down so you can see them. It's got the privacy shades there. On all the windows. Nice dinette. Built in microwave. Breakfast bar, two stools. Ducted roof air. Here's the power panel. It's all the features clearly marked. Propane gas leak detector. And all the outlets you got up here. GFI outlet in the kitchen. Another second GFI outlet in the kitchen. And here's your power panel. Water heater igniter switch. There's the control for the heat and the air conditioner. Ducted roof air. Okay, guess that sums up our video. Come on and see us at Kelly Hicks Construction in Sublette, Illinois. We're located right on US Route 52, North Central Illinois. This is the Wildwood. It's a 2010 Wildwood LA Model 292 FKDS with lots of options. This is not a stripped down camper. You Canada pipeline workers should jump on this one. It's at a good price. Your dollar's pretty strong. It's got a heated enclosed underbelly. You can camp in it four seasons. See, I got the slide out slid in. Well, anyhow, be sure to check all my other auctions. Call and ask any questions. Feel free to email me with any questions. I guess the last thing I should say about this is the unloaded vehicle weight. It's 75, 77 pounds. And it can carry 3,000 pounds worth of cargo. Thanks for watching my video.